I'm such a huge fan of the work that Community Mediation Maryland does. We need to be investing in um, mediation processes that help people coming out of prison um, rebuild all of the major relationships um, in their lives. It's a very organic environment. You can't force people to build relationships in three days. It's amazing what getting people together in the same room and to talk about the issues they have with one another, uh, what that can do. Um, I think the difference between visitation and mediation, like we, we are there to talk about issues. The reentry program that we offer um, across the state of Maryland and here in Baltimore City seeks to heal relationships. Uh, in a way that allows incarcerated folks, their friends and family members to make plans for their future when they come home. People come back out. And, you know, if you serve your time, you should be able to come out and have the best opportunity, a successful life, reuniting with family and friends and, and being a part of our community. On the inside, we know nothing about this going on. We don't know that there are people out here, all races, all backgrounds, that are fighting for us to get back on track. We don't know that in prison. And now, for the first time in my entire life, not only do I have a relationship with my brother, but I have a positive one. There's something about the power of people being in the same room and looking in each other's eyes and really saying what's real for them. You know it, you feel it between you. What community mediation does is that it reduces that recidivism rate by engaging people in the most critical uh, parts of the process. Because without you guys, I think a lot of issues that we resolved would not came up. So that's why I'm here today. That's why I support Laura. That's why I support this organization. Because I think that mediation and different ways of doing things is how we're going to change our city, our, our state, and our country.